Hey everybody, I brought with me, not just any old friend, but my three kids, Dimitri, Noel, yeah. and Emil. Brothers and sisters. Do you have brothers and sisters? You do? Do you ever fight? Do you guys ever fight? Yeah. yeah. They kind of fight sometimes. A lot. Well, we have a song about what to do when you're tempted to sin or say the wrong thing or do the wrong thing. You have to tell yourself, stop, right? Think about it. Don't do it. Don't do it. What would Jesus do? What, what would Jesus, Jesus do? do? We're looking not at your brother and sister and telling them to stop, but we're telling ourselves. We're going to say it to ourselves. S-T-O-P, stop. Think about it. Don't do it. Don't do it. What would Jesus do? Because you're all made in God's image. It's really hard, especially with your brothers and sisters, but they're going to help us. And if you want to hear something cool on this CD, Dimitri and Noel are singing on it. And that little kid right there, that little one-year-old boy, he's 10 now. That's Emil. Now he's going to help sing along with us. All right, guys, let's do it. Press play, Emil. All right, do it with me. Noel's got her special hand to help out. Gauntlet. When you're tempted to sin or do the wrong thing, you've got to freeze and say this to yourself. To yourself. S T O P. Stop. Think about it. Don't do it. Don't do it. What would Jesus do? What would Jesus do? When you're tempted to sin or say the wrong thing, you've got to freeze. And say this to yourself. To yourself. S T O P. Stop. Think about it. Don't do it. Don't do it. What would Jesus do? What would Jesus do? Put your pride on the shelf and point only to yourself. And you say this to yourself every day, every day. Thank you, Dimitri Noel, and we'll give them a big hand. Yeah, you watch my YouTube video. Have a nice day. Thank y'all. Bye. Bye-bye. So sometimes we fight. That's what brothers and sisters do, but we have to ask for forgiveness. And one of the ways that we battle those thoughts and those temptations is we pray. We pray. Look at this word here. Can you read the word? It says P-R-A-Y. Pray. Pray, pray, pray. We've got to pray every day. Get down on your knees, I say, and P-R-A-Y, pray. What does P stand for? When we pray, the first thing we should do is praise. Praise God. We think, what can I thank God for? What can I thank God for? Like, every day we have to look about what happened during the day and what I can be thankful for. Like if you took Holy Communion, we thank God for that. We thank God for the beautiful weather. We thank God that we're not hungry, that we have food to eat. We thank God for our health. The list can go on and on. The second thing we do, so first, P is for praise. Thank God for all of your days. A grateful heart is full of love, so get down, give thanks and praise. R is, anybody know what the R stands for? St. John the Baptist preached it all the time. Repent. Forgive me when I go the wrong way. You've got to ask God to forgive you. Every day we make mistakes because we're not perfect. Sometimes we stop and we think about it and we don't say that. We stopped ourselves or we don't think that thought or do that action that we shouldn't have done. Sometimes by the grace of God, we did not fall into temptation or sin. But other times, we mess up. And so repent is saying, I'm going to fess up. Lord, forgive me. So every night when you pray, think about your day and what we need to ask God to forgive us for. And sometimes we actually go to our brothers and sisters and ask for forgiveness to them as well. All right, the next letter in pray is A. A stands for ask. Ask for others. Okay, this is a great time to pray for those who request our prayers. Maybe you have a friend who's sick, or you wanna pray for a family member, or, or a classmate, 
or someone you live in your neighborhood, someone at your church. We pray for others. We don't just pray for ourselves. Notice that we have not prayed for ourselves yet. We ask, we praise God, we, we, we ask for forgiveness, we ask for others. And lastly, why stands for yourself. Now you can pray for yourself. God wants us to pray for ourselves, but we shouldn't be the first on the list. So we're going to sing a song called Pray. And let me get the track ready and sing along with me if you know it. got to pray every day. Get down on your knees, I say. Get down, thanks and pray. P is for praise. Thank God for all of your days. A grateful heart is full of love, so get down, give thanks and praise. R is repent. Forgive me when I go the wrong way. We have to forgive ourselves too when we mess up. A Ask for others, like your family and your friends. And if there's someone you don't like, then pray that you make amends. Why is yourself? At last it is your turn. Lord, have mercy on my soul. I yearn and yearn for you, God. Yes. Come on, guys, sing along. You know this song, right? All right. Let's sing it again with the regular track. All right, let's try it again. Pray, pray, pray. You got to pray every day. Get down on your knees, I say, and P R A Y pray. Pray, pray, pray. We've got to pray every day. Get down on your knees, I say, and P R A Y pray. Turn it off, block the noise. Listen up, you girls and boys. Get down on your knees each day and pray, pray, pray. P is for praise. Thank God for all of your days. A grateful heart is full of love, so get down, give thanks, and pray. R is repent. Forgive me when I go the wrong way. Reflect upon your day each day and repent when you pray. A like your family and your friends and if there's someone you don't like then pray that you make amends why is yourself at last it is your turn pray for your salvation let god's love in your heart burn turn it off turn off the tv listen up you girls and boys get down on your knees each day and p-r-a-y that's right. Get down on your knees each day. P-R-A-Y pray. Thank you guys for listening. I hope you're being good boys and girls, good kids to your parents. And we'll see you next time for Music with Gigi.